auntie happy mancha happy saturday i hope you are enjoying your weekend currently guys well i'm staying in this weekend i just um felt like yo i really need to rest i'm extremely tired and i need to get ready for the coming week because uh, i need to give you good content guys <laughs> so guys on today's video uh, i'm gonna talk about uh if filipinos are racist or not <laughs> i hope i know you knew this video will be coming soon but i thought i'd do it for you guys to know the kind of place philippines is the kind of people that they are but before we go right into it guys please subscribe to my youtube channel make sure you hit the notification bell so that you're notified every time i upload a video share my videos with your family and friends let them know to subscribe as well and like and comment guys let me know what you think about my videos and uh yeah let's get to 5,000 subscribers guys we still have to keep pushing and uh getting those numbers rolling uh we need 5,000 subscribers by the end of this coming month guys keep supporting happy mancha and thank you so much for the returning subscribers who've been with me from day one the ones that came after and are still here the new ones welcome to happy mancha stick around because we are going all out into the world and i'm taking you with me all right <laughs> so now let's start and uh yeah the first one is i don't think filipinos are racist guys like they are the most nicest people i've ever met my whole entire life okay and i mean it i'm not just doing it for the video no i mean it and um i think that also uh a lot of people who can agree with me on that one that i've visited the philippines filipinos are extremely nice when i mean extremely i mean <laughs> overly nice i've never met people who are as nice as filipinos like they are people who will want to have a conversation with you and actually want to have it not like it's a forced uh conversation they would like to know more about you uh they'd like to know where you come from how life is where you're coming from and they will even teach you about their own country like oh be careful around the streets and all of that i just love people who are selfless like that uh that feel like um you know you need to know certain things in, within their country that maybe you're not aware of or just for uh cautiousness you understand so i really think they are the nicest people honestly number two is that uh filipinos love to ask questions and it's not questions like they are trying to offend you in any way or intimidate you in any way no they just want to know so much about you they're like very curious people they be like oh where where, where are you from ma'am or oh, you have friends here where have you been in philippines ma'am that's just how they love to ask questions it's not that um they they just want to get something out of you no it's just a way of uh, building a conversation getting to know you better or maybe just getting to know some things about where you come from that they don't know about you know it's just curiosity and i love it because um it's nice to have conversations with people you never know where those conversations will lead to right <laughs> number three like I mentioned before they love to ask where you come from that curious about African countries I don't know if they that they also ask anyone from Africa maybe from a different maybe from Europe where they're from and all of that but I know my own experience they love to ask about African countries like where are you from uh, they would like to know the kind of food that we eat and all of that so it's just one of those you know um basic questions like even i when i am here for me to get to know the philippines better i have to ask someone who lives here and it's filipinos i do ask a lot of questions um the food that they eat the places they they go to and uh how the places are are they safe and all of that it's just curiosity and yeah they always give the right answers and very good answers helpful answers number 
four <laughs> which is the one that i love so much guys filipinos love eating yo yo filipinos live to eat okay they love food so much they are always out eating if you go to the mall if you just walk across the nearest restaurant close to you people are seated okay eating and enjoying their food they love eating so much and they unapologetically love it <laughs> you know and it's a nice thing to come into a country where people just in embrace you know embrace eating so much it is good guys eating is good there's nothing wrong with eating and loving food and i love such people so much because um food is very important in our daily lives they are very comfortable with that kind of life they love eating restaurants are always packed up they're always in the shops buying whoa even in the aircraft traveling they always have snacks with them like once they start sitting down you see them grabbing all these packs of chips bread <laughs> it's so fun guys it's so fun to watch because um yes uh where i come from we do eat but like if i had to compare it to where i come from we eat because it's a necessity you know um but here they eat because um it's a necessity and also it's like a hobby you know it's like they they enjoy if they had one thing and one thing to do only that will be eating and it's a good thing i love it <laughs> the other thing i love about filipinos guys they love they actually love youtube guys i think they are people who, are, who just love social media in general they love youtube so much if you tell them that you are a youtube vlogger they'll be like oh ma'am blogger blogger <laughs> and they'll be like what's your channel ma'am they subscribe immediately they love youtube so much so if you are in philippines you are in the right place they'll give you the utmost support that they can give you you know so yeah they really do love youtube <laughs> and one other thing that i love the most that i truly truly love the most about filipinos is how well mannered they are everywhere you go they address you ma'am or sir so everywhere i've gone i've been addressed as ma'am do you know how big the ma'am carries the weight of ma'am it carries so much respect for someone it's wow it's so beautiful like they the in a, in a sentence you can hear five mems just in one sentence like a good day ma'am ma'am would you like this with uh this ma'am and ma'am ma ma like ma'am sir do you know the weight of those words it's so much respect and i love it so much because you know it is something we were taught when we were young that uh, charity begins at home if um, when you come across a country like philippines and you hear everyone addressing you the same way it's something they've been taught like from a young age like you are supposed to respect people they even yourself you have to respect them the same respect they give you you have to give it back you can if someone cannot call you ma'am and then you address them anyhow so i'm also learning to call them ma'am all the time ma'am all the time yeah even in my country i mean we do call the elderly ma'am but it's like rare it's rare for for someone to um to hear it everywhere they go you know for instance you go into a restaurant you go into a taxi you go like everywhere even at night midnight in in a club or whatever they they still address you the same way yeah so that's why i'm saying in my country we have it but it's rare like i wouldn't hear it every where in the streets but i'll definitely hear it if i'm talking to an elderly person we say ma or ra back at home but uh it's very rare um between an elderly person and a younger person like an elderly person saying ma'am to a younger one but here the elderly person can still say ma'am 
or say it to you, which is <laughs> so crazy. So that's that's the only difference. Uh, it's rare that uh, the elderly person could say mem to the younger one, you know. But here, guys, it's the life, and it's a beautiful life, guys. If uh, someone had to call you mem when they're older than you, it's really an amazing experience. <laughs> And the other thing is they love complimenting guys. They will compliment you the whole entire day like ma'am You're so beautiful Ma'am, where do you come from? You look so beautiful. Ma'am, I love your hair <laughs> They love complimenting so much and it's uh, ah, it's an amazing feeling guys. So you also have to uh, Compliment them guys. They are actually really beautiful people. They, they just have beautiful souls. Yeah <laughs> and The other thing is guys here in philippines they have the best i mean the best customer service if not in the world then it's one of the best uh, countries with good customer service like i'm saying how they address you how fast the service is and just how organized everything is you know they they really put so much work into giving a uh, good customer service you won't be disappointed if you go into the restaurant you are in the taxi the taxi men the cars like always smell so good and they're always very clean the taxi man will just do his job accordingly if you don't know anything we will go into the map and search it together and all of that that is good customer service guys i wouldn't even stress this uh, more enough i really love good customer service because you need to be satisfied with the kind of service that you are pouring your money into you know so if you come across philippines just know that um you won't be disappointed they they they, they, they just do their work guys and uh uh, it's really impressive honestly it's really impressive finally what i do not like is the thought that i know i'm going to eventually leave philippines that's what i don't like because i'm so attached to, i'm so attached to this place already like it is i don't feel like living it is so comfortable even um everything is there guys they have everything there's nothing you can lack in this place they have absolutely everything so i'm i'm so attached to it already and i don't like that thought i don't like that thought to know that i'm gonna leave eventually ah! <laughs> but anyway guys but anyway guys i hope you enjoyed this video because yeah i just had to say it i had to do a video and in just appreciating the philippines because it's so it's so nice here and um oh my god it's so comfortable so for me i just feel like i'm feeling so sad for myself i i pity myself that i'm going to leave this kind of a country because this is like a dream country this is where if ever i was to think where can i leave where I, there's everything where they i'm comfortable where the people are nice there's no racism people won't look at me awkward philippines is the right place to be guys and uh, i am satisfied with it and uh yeah to my filipino people i love you lots and i hope you guys enjoy this video and i got a new hairdo guys <laughs> i got a new hairdo guys and uh yeah i've been busy getting myself together because um the hair the hairstyle that i had was worn out so yeah um tomorrow we're starting off again more videos more videos guys keep subscribing make sure you hit that notification bell make sure you share my videos guys share my videos get the word out there happy mancha and uh yeah just support your girl guys and i will see you on my next video from me today it's all love toodles toodles <laughs>